Hello. I want to. I want to talk about Paris. I want to talk about. Oh. Paris. I, talk about oh. I knew it, but was I'm she sorry. To somebody that was else? my fault. That was my fault. Was she talking to somebody else? I think so. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I didn't even say her name. So. She wants to talk about cool ass. Yeah. That's awesome that she wants to talk about cool ass. <laughs> yeah. That was all me. I'm sorry, Anderson. I I totally you wanted. You saw me stand up immediately. I know, but I I wanted. Like I was to, waiting too. I I love getting a sneak peek into someone's private conversation. But they're all just so rife with with cuss words. I know. Yeah, there are callers. Hello, Kendall. Hey, Kendall. Hey, yeah. Don't don't hello, don't hello, hello. don't. Hey, don't cuss on the radio Not anymore. Her fault, I, I I don't mean to be insensitive about it, but I have like a few things that it would be really cool to talk about on the radio about. Well, you're on I mean, the radio. You're so on the radio. So get with it. Thank you. Thank you. So three things like. I'm I'm calling Loveline because I would love to talk to Dr. Drew and Mike about the situation. Uh, that Kendall, I have. Kendall, Personally. Kendall, 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 yeah. yeah. you're you're on the radio with us. Hey, hey, everybody. Um, so I want I want to say two things, two two three things. <laughs> so I want I want to say that like it's an absolute absolute devastating travesty. I want I want to give everybody my absolute condolences god i just i wish i could do so much more than i can do to just help with what everybody that affected in paris oh, and everything okay. i yeah i i i want to give my condolences but um i well, want to say that. that i learned i learned today because like you know i am somebody who gets news from you know the internet and I learned that one of the one of the mother mother effers, I should say, that was involved with killing innocent people, they had a passport as far as being like like a refugee to like flee. And that sucks so bad. It it makes uh it makes no sense and Anyway, well, it makes a lot of sense, but it doesn't. It doesn't. Doesn't make me well, feel very here's good. Here's the thing. No, it's it's bad. It's bad. Of course, like, conservative conservative people are like, well, we don't want these refugees into our country because there's these terrorist cells within, and then we're all we're all thinking like, are you kidding? Like, no, we we want to accept these people. They're fleeing. They're fleeing these countries and they're and they're and they're fleeing these like kendall terrorist people. kendall yes. hello hello uh yeah. hello. i i appreciate that you're so sympathetic to everyone affected in paris uh i really do yeah. but is there something you wanted to talk about that's more maybe germane to loveline and your personal life oh totally 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 okay. yes i went on the tangent but yes I, it's okay i would like to tell i yes so much so. <laughs> so I much. I would like to ask Dr. Drew. I'd like to ask Mike, or I'd like to ask anybody who's on the show tonight. Mm -hmm. I, have a, I have a personal affect. Uh, I lost my mom. I'm like, I'm wondering. I want, I want them to like give me some advice about like seeking therapy. Can you can, can you I please also... stop referring to us as them? You're talking to Mike and Drew. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Okay. You have been the whole time. Yes. Okay. 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 What would you like okay, to ask cool. Drew or me? I would like to ask Drew in a biological sense. I have like this like kissing thing that I do. <laughs> I think this we should deal. Weird, I think but, we should uh, deal with the substance issues. Yeah. What what I, drugs are you on? I think the substance issues are primary. Whatever else is coming, not, nothing. Not. Not any, not any, but like... Then I you need help. help. Then you need um, serious help. If you're not on drugs right now, then you need to be in a hospital. I think we got on the wrong foot. I don't think that that's the situation, but... Are you drunk? I, um, no. No. No, okay. no, no. Okay, so... I, I would like to ask Dr. Drew, and like he is a doctor, and Mike because he has a lot of like really like good like sense uh, for. Okay. Yes. I, I can. 
I I get I get to like wanting to like I have like a like a pee thing and then like I think I can stop my pee and it like goes into like a different like chamber. <laughs> uh, oh, dude, it's weird. It's weird. Okay, so I think that like I can stop my changes into like I. <sighs> Too many, too many bad words. And and also... And no question. <laughs> and you're with me, right? Yeah. Like, if she's not on any substance, that's just her brain okay, normally? She's on, she's on lots of drugs. She's like, if we talk to her tomorrow sober, she'd be like, oh, yeah, I was on a lot of drugs. She reminds me that... What was the girl that was outside that hamburger place, that Astro Burger or whatever? The Smash Burger. Smash Burger. Remember her? By the way, Smash Burger's down the street. I right know now. that now. And it's uh, one like at the uh, Nokia Center. It's delicious. It used to be Nokia. Smash Burger's delicious. And we didn't had no idea what it was back then. Well, yeah. I didn't. Uh, <laughs> but remember her? She was, com- and then she called us back like two hours later and was sober. Yeah. Remember? I, yeah. And then she she kept saying, "I'm meeting this guy at IHOP." Right. And we're like, "Why are you going to IHOP?" She's like, "It's the International House of Prayer." <laughs> like you could, I'm going to kill you. One eight hundred love one 19- nine.